Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video for you all talking all about my favorites of 2019 kind of. Even though 2019 is not over yet, we're in the second to the last month of the year. We're in November. I wanted to do a favorites video, but instead of just doing a traditional favorites of products that I really love, I'm gonna talk about products mainly that I used up and repurchased. If you guys know anything about me, you know it takes a long time, a long periodically time for me to end a product, for me to like get to the end, to the bottom, scraping out the inside. I have so many products that I try out and get new ones and things like that. It's really hard for me to go through an actual full jar or bottle of product. I've been collecting, you know, all of the products that I've used up throughout the year. Um, some of them are not in here. I threw them away on accident, but this is most of the stuff that I try to keep to remember to talk about. I will um, also be sharing with you guys which products I've repurchased. Um, before we move forward, this video is in partnership with Shop Tagger. If you guys know anything about me, you know I love to shop online. A lot of these products I buy online. It's not just great for clothing, which is why I usually talk about Shop Tagger, but it's also great for skincare, body products, things like that too. I use it to keep track of sales. I use it to keep track of whether or not something is in stock. It's gonna come in super clutch for Black Friday and for the holiday sales. Trust me, you're gonna wanna be signed up. So I'm gonna put a tutorial in the video right now so you guys can check out how to download Shop Tiger for yourselves and then we can get to the actual stuff that I ran out of. So downloading Shop Tiger is super simple. You're just gonna go to shoptiger.com and click get Shop Tiger. From there, you'll go to the Chrome web store and it'll add the extension to your Chrome browser. Once the extension has been added, you can go ahead and sign in or create an account. I already have an account, so I'm just going to sign in. And after you've signed in, it's going to take you to this page, which will basically just give you some suggestions on where you can actually use the Shop Tiger app. So it's gonna take you to a little demo and I'm gonna show you guys how to use it. Basically, you'll just click this little button on the side of your screen when you find something that you like and you can choose when you want to get notifications. So if you wanna see the price changes, when it goes on sale or comes back in stock, things like that. And you can add it to any list that you want. I already have a ton of lists, but I wanted to add it to a beauty list for beauty products. So I made a beauty list and saved it there. And then you have it in your account with all of your items. And then any items that you save in here, it's gonna let you know when they go in stock, out of stock, or on sale. And then once you put it in your basket, it can give you suggestions on different coupons that you can use. You can test those coupons to see if they actually work. Shop Tiger is doing a great job in trying to be as resourceful as possible so that you can get the best deal that you can possibly get. This is gonna be super helpful for the upcoming holiday season because you'll get to see all of your items in one place. You can save gift ideas here or you can make gift ideas for other people. You can share your list that you like with other people so they can see what you like and they can get the best deal on it so it's really really helpful if you guys want to download shop tagger I have a link in the description box to where you can do that and check it out there let's go ahead and get started with the empties the products that I have been enjoying I think I have maybe like one or two makeup products in here and to be quite honest with y'all I do not run out of makeup I don't wear makeup on a daily basis to actually run out of enough stuff um, to talk about in this video the only thing I ever really run out of is eyebrow products. And that's usually just my eyebrow pencil, which my favorite one is ColourPop brow pencil. And I also run out of the benefits they keep sending them to me. So I never really run out. I don't really have any makeup to talk about, honestly. Um, so I'm sorry if this video is mostly skincare, but anyways, let's go ahead and get started because I'm rambling, I'm talking way too much. Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser um, by Glow Recipe. And this was one of the products that I mentioned in a video way back when. I don't even remember when I talked about this product. I just remember getting it in the mail and I was so excited about it. And then I think I gave it away and then I went and bought it from Sephora because I really wanted to try it. Um, that happens to me a lot. Sometimes I'll get stuff in the mail and then I'll be like, oh, that's cool. I'll give it away. And then I'll be like, you know what? I actually really wanted to try that and I'll go buy it. Really loved this obviously because I used it all up. I mean, there is like maybe two drops left in here that I probably could have squoze out, but this one was a good one. It smells just like blueberry. So if you don't like the smell of blueberry, um, you probably wouldn't like this, but I really liked it. I used it pretty religiously. Um, this is one of those products that I just kept on my sink and whenever I needed to wash my face, I just grabbed it. I feel like this one worked pretty much all year round and that's why I was able to empty her out. All right, next up is the uh, TLC Glycolic Night Serum 
and this is by drunk elephant you guys know i love drunk elephant i talk about it every time i do a skincare video i pretty much i think i talk about drunk elephant i've tried all of their products every single one this one being the one that i run out of the fastest for sure um this one i alternate in between uh this and the sunday riley good jeans um those are the two glycolic acid serums that i typically use i have gotten new ones uh, more recently like Ula Henriksen um, which I've been using some of their AHA stuff too and I've been trying ordinary stuff late recently um, so I haven't really had a need to buy more it's hard to tell um, if it's actually empty but it's empty I mean I've been trying to squeeze something out of it for a while now and it has not pumped out anything but yeah, I love the glycolic acid serum you guys know they help with resurfacing the skin getting rid of the dark spots I have a whole dark spot playlist so if you want to hear every single thing I know about dark spots and how I got rid of them watch those videos it'll be up here in the card section so you can check that out actually something that is not completely empty but I'm getting to the bottom it's funny because I use this every night and I still haven't reached the bottom yet it only takes a little bit though a little bit goes a long way but this is the Laneige let me show y'all before I open it this is the Laneige sleeping mask I believe I purchased it at the end of last year I know for sure that it has taken me all year to get to the bottom of this like it seems like I should have ran out of this a lot quicker because I got big lips and I use this every night but I mean it's taken me a hot minute to get to the bottom so that just shows you how long it takes to, to empty this product and it works wonders it's the most amazing sleeping mask for winter time you definitely need to get your hands on it i love it i actually just ordered another one on sephora i got they have a mint chocolate chip one so i'm going to try that flavor because ooh, i fought tooth and nail to find this okay i did not rest until i found this product i literally am obsessed with it i use it every night before i go to bed it smells so good and this is the fresh sugar body oil I don't even know where the top is. That's how much I love it. If the top is gone, you know it's real. She is completely empty. I mean, I tried to get as much out as possible um, and the bottle is like really oily. It is an amazing oil. It smells really, really good. I use it on my body, mostly in my nether regions. So when I get out the shower, this is what I put on. It makes me smell delectable, um, which I need. I love this oil. Um, it gives me no problems it has been sold out on sephora i actually like i said use shop tagger to keep track of um when it comes back in stock i looked on the fresh website i looked on you mean marcus website nordstrom website this product does not exist online i even reached out to the fresh company and asked them could you please let me know if this is in stock if they do if you have it send it to me i'll buy it whatever just let me know where it's at and they could not locate it only place I could find it was Blue Mercury. I ended up actually going to the store um, near me and they had it, so I bought two bottles. But I do love that oil, okay? And I will be patiently waiting by my shop tagger for when it comes back in stock and I will be buying more. This is another one of my favorites. This is the Nourishing Dry Body Oil Creme de Corp. Um, and this is Kiehl's. Got it last year. Was that last year? I don't even remember when I got this. I like it because it was a spray bottle. Typically when I get out of the shower, I do like to oil up. I like to go to bed slick, okay? The dry oil, I like to use on my legs, my arms, larger surface areas where I just need to do really quick. I like to be quick with things just like y'all do, okay? I know some of y'all go to bed ashy, but that's not my life. You know, I use it all up when bought another one. Have been obsessed with Lush body washes this year. As you guys know, and I talked about this in my booty facial video, I try to use vegan, vegetarian, all natural body washes these days because I do have sensitive skin on my body as well as my face. So I do like to use products that are going to aid in keeping me from breaking out. So this is It's Raining Men Shower Gel. Now, Lush actually got rid of the name of this product, but they kept the product. So it's the same product, they just renamed it. It's called Honey Eye Wash the Kids. That's the new name of their um, honey body wash, but it's the same body wash, just a different name. It took me about three or four months, I believe. Next up is the Fresh Youth Preserve Dream Face Cream. And um, this is their Night Recovery Cream. Love this. I think I'm gonna go buy it because um, I actually probably should have put this in my Sephora cart. I don't know why I didn't, but I did use it all up. 
and I got this one in a PR package, but I would actually purchase this again. I think I might. I don't really remember what it was doing for me, but I just know that every other face cream that I've been using for nighttime hasn't been the same. Like it doesn't hit the same as this one does. This is one of those products that I've repurchased time and time again. I'm gonna have to look through my Sephora account to see how many times I've actually repurchased this because I know I've repurchased it um, and I've been obsessed with it. This is the Peace Out Acne Healing Dots. And I use one of these Every time I have a pimple, I need to buy some more because this side of my face is really broken out. I don't know what happened to me. Probably the hair like draping down the sides of my face because that's where I broke. But I didn't break out on this side, so I don't know sis. They're clear stickers, so you can't really see them, which I like because that way I can go to bed without looking like crazy. I don't like to go to bed with open wounds on my face, especially if I pop them that night, which I'm not supposed to do, but I do it anyways. I have not really found anything else to be as efficient as this because I think these cover well and they also really do help shrink my pimples overnight. So try these out. These are $20 a pop at Sephora. Another product that I have been loving this year is the Super Goop Daily Moisturizer with SPF 40. This is their Super Screen. I had a partnership with Super Goop earlier this year. I think it was in January. And I actually got to try this product out before it hit shelves. But I actually really did love this product. Um, and I used it all up. I've used two jars so far. Look at that. It's pretty empty. I started keeping them after I threw away my first jar. So this is my second jar that I used up. Yeah, I really love that. Um, it's perfect for the winter time. I didn't really use it as much in the summer. Love all of their sunscreen products. I've tried every single one of them. That's the one that I typically run out of the most. If you guys are, you know, darker skinned and you need a nice sunscreen that doesn't turn your face purple, that is a good one. All right, we got some makeup. We got one makeup product in here, just one. This is Laura Mercier um, and this is the Translucent Medium Deep. I didn't even realize that I ran out of this until I tried to like take some out and it's like empty. I got some hair products in here, mostly just edge control. Uh, this is Lovely Bees, Lovely Brianna um, on Instagram. I believe her YouTube channel is probably under the same name, um, but she does mostly hair videos. She has her own hair company. I met her in LA uh, a couple weeks ago. She's really, really sweet. Um, but her edge control is bomb, used it all up, and I bought three more on Amazon because um, they were like sold out for a couple months. And what I tried while I was waiting for my lovely bees to come back in stock was the Style Factor Edge Booster. Um, and I got this from my local beauty supply store. Did scrape out the entire thing. This he this one is really heavy duty. Um, it lasts through humidity. It, it really does work. The only thing I don't like about this one is that it cakes up easy. So if you put more on top of some that you've already applied, it will turn white. I don't care for that as much, uh, so I do have to be very careful with this. You wouldn't want to use this all throughout your hair, mostly just on the edges. But the Lovely Bees does not turn my hair white at all, so that's why I really like that one more, because I can put on as much as I need to, and it won't do that. Um, all right, so next up is this Slay Makeup Melting Butter Cleanser, and this is by Drunk Elephant. I did make a skincare video earlier this year. I believe, yeah, it was in partnership with Drunk Elephant in Sephora, inside JCPenney, and I was talking about this product um, for removing your makeup. It was, I believe, a get unready with me. Um, I actually ended up emptying this out. I scraped out all of it. And then I put shea butter in here and was using it for shea butter. Because, simply because of the fact that this comes with a scooper that magnetically attaches to the actual jar. Um, I do have other makeup removers that I use now, but I don't like them as much as this one simply because it comes with this packaging. Like, this is genius. If you're gonna get a makeup remover, I would suggest this one simply for the fact that it comes with this. My other favorites, you guys already know, Clinique Take the Day Off Balm and the Pharmacy Makeup Melting uh, Cleanser stuff. Um, that one's really good too, but this one has that, you know, it has a scooper that I just love, so. This is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturizer. Used all of this bad boy up. I don't remember exactly when I got this for the first time, um, but I know that I've used up more than two bottles of this. I really, really enjoyed this one as well. This is a really good oily skin moisturizer um, because it doesn't leave your skin greasy or like heavy feeling. So if you have oily skin, that's a really good moisturizer for you. And it smells like watermelon. So why wouldn't you want it? Why wouldn't you want the watermelon on your face? You know what I'm saying? This is Sunday Riley Good Jeans. 
clearly you guys know I love this I talk about it in every single skincare video that I've done talking about dark spots so obviously I was gonna talk about this do not like spending a hundred dollars on this but when I get desperate this is what I use and I think I've bought this maybe four times if you have any type type of scarring hyperpigmentation this is going to change the game for you another facial cleanser I forgot about this one this is the matcha hemp hydrating cleanser I don't even remember what PR package I got this in but I used it all up so I liked it I just I remember using this every day and I was like it works sis and then the last thing i have in here is the ingrown hair serum from you know where i go european wax center um if you get wax there you should definitely try it out um i've emptied out so many of those bottles i feel like that's like my fourth or fifth one that i've been through so if you need an ingrown hair serum it does work pretty well i believe it also has glycolic acid in it um so it definitely does help with getting rid of dark spots and things like that too. The last thing that I wanna talk about is actually not a makeup or skincare product. It is a candle. It was full to the top at the beginning of the year and it is now empty. So I definitely have this in my shop tagger. I'm waiting patiently. It is expensive. It's $178, but I got it last year for 20% off, I believe, around Black Friday. So that's what I'm waiting for again. So like I said, if you guys sign up for Shop Tagger, you can put this in your Shop Tagger and wait for it to go on sale because it's worth it. Trust me, I bought it last November. It was back ordered, so it delivered to me in December or January. And it took me all year to get to the bottom. So, I mean, if you are tired of buying 80 candles from Bath and Body Works, Anthropology Candle is the way to go, okay? The Capri Blue, I believe that's the name of it, Capri Blue Volcano Colossal, something like that. I'll put a link in the description box, you guys already know. This candle made my whole entire year. Like, I used it every, well, not every day. I use it at least once a week, so I don't live in a huge house. But if you live in a, an apartment or a condo town home this will smell up your entire house i was so happy that i got it it was worth every penny i mean think about how much money you spend on bath and body Works candles a year add all that up subtract that from 178 it's probably going to be in the negative this is a great deal i get so many compliments on it like oh that's a beautiful candle it smells so good you need this in your life that is all for this video i hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did please be sure to give me a thumbs up be sure to check the description box for all the links and everything that you need including where to get this shirt my jewelry or thing like that um if you'd like to see a video on my hair color because i know some of y'all probably didn't see that go ahead and click up here it'll be up there in the card section as well yeah that's it i hope that you guys enjoy this i will talk to you guys in my next video all right <laughs>